Well, the American dream brought many of our families here years ago, some a little more recently. For many, it's a chance to leave a tough situation behind and make a better life. Number 7 Sean Toll has the story of one refugee who is using art to create a new life in Denver. To use the cliche, art provides inspiration. I've been coming to this school for a little over a year. But at the Real Academy of Art in Denver, the director provides both. He is a master. He's really talented. Ali Ghassan came to America five years ago from Iraq with a simple dream. I came here at the first time with my dream. I came to create. This is a school. It wasn't as simple as a dab of paint. First time to United States, I'm not speaking English. <laughs> That's the big issue. <laughs> he worked to save money, bought materials, and rented a small space. I came over and it's been great ever since. We've really expanded. Going from that space to a school of more than 40 students, one dream made a masterpiece until last week when dream number two came true. Oh, I'm an American citizen. Students sharing their congrats and bringing more red, white, and blue to a palette filled with color. We're all really happy. I feel he's a better American than any of the rest of us. I'm so happy for that. The people here is very nice. And much like art, He's not done showing the light. What next? I, of course, uh, uh, the dream is not going to be stopped. He hopes to turn this to an art university one day, which, given the path so far, only feels a few brush strokes away. It's really inspiring. It just really shows that you can do whatever you want. It doesn't matter where you come from as long as you have a dream. Taking what was a blank canvas and filling it with dreams, all that was needed? The right inspiration. Thanks. Sean Toll, Denver 7.